Green Bay women's basketball team has had plenty of local talent who went on to star for the Phoenix, but one player on their roster has seen her opportunity to shine cut a bit short. Ryan Rodick has her story. The beginning of the season was different for Anna Deer. Coach Bronk one day made a joke that I was one of the healthiest people on the court, and I, that's just, it was very rare for me. <laughs> As Green Bay was battling the injury bug, the redshirt junior found herself in an unfamiliar position for the Phoenix on the floor. It's really exciting just to be on the court, getting to play basketball, and I mean, that's ultimately like what I want to do, just play the game I love, so I was really happy to be back. The former high school state champion tore the anterior cruciate ligament in her left knee as a junior at Algoma, then tore the same ACL as a freshman at GB and a third time while she was nearly done rehabbing nine months later. Everybody saw the amount of work that she put in and not once did she ever complain about it. I've got a picture of her still with all of her goals. You know, this is where she's at and this is when I'm gonna come back and play. Then just as Deer earned a starting spot and was averaging career highs in minutes, points and rebounds, the unthinkable happened last month. A couple minutes into the game, I pivoted and. Uh, I just knew something wasn't right. For the fourth time in five years, the forward blew out her knee. I never would have expected it was going to be on my opposite leg. And with that, Deer had to call it a career. I wouldn't change my experience, obviously. I would have rather not had the injuries, but I'm excited. That, I mean, I'm happy that I chose the program I did, and I did as much of it as I could. Because Deer worked just as hard in the classroom as she did right here on the court, she earned her undergraduate degree in just three years. Now she's pursuing her master's and a job as a teacher, but she hasn't given up on the game she loves either. I definitely want to coach. I know that's going to be part of my future just because I always want basketball in my life in some way. In Green Bay, Ryan Rodig, Local 5 Sports.